Well, first off, if that damn ice cream truck would go away, things would be better. But anyway, what you see in front of you is a first-gen Lakewood. What could be a two, P237. And I admit I may have overpaid for this, which was 40 bucks for the fan and another 40 for shipping. And it has no front cage. And unfortunately, the back cage got mangled somehow, as well as the fan itself. I'm not worried about it because I knew these cages are garbage to begin with. McMillan motor. So, I mean, well, let's plug it up and see what it can do. Yeah. So I guess if we're ready. Here's all right. Beat to hell, but it works. Since there's unfortunately no information available, I'm assuming it's running at 2.2 amps. So I could be wrong. Maybe 2.5, which is kind of a little bit generous, but I'm still going with a 2.2. .2. Here's how it. Here's how it. About. 187 watts medium thirty three watts one point six six amps and the lows one point two and 100. Probably a bit more efficient if I put oil in it. Yeah, about right. 2.2, maybe 2.3. Okay, this is going to do it for this video of this beat up circa 75 76 Lakewood P237, which I admit I sort of overpaid, but when are you going to find another P237? You're not. I mean, it does need to be cleaned up a bit, some new cages, which I'll probably jury rig something, and oil in the motor. Yeah, get the oil motored up, but I mean, it's got promise, but at the end of the day, it's also got the first gen blade, so I think the blade itself might be worth more than the fan itself, but that's just me. So, we'll see what happens come next time. So, until then, I'm asking you thanks for watching.
Gaan we achterover. Ja.